All right, today we're gonna go over how to load a full reel of active components or components on a plastic tape onto an eight millimeter Yamaha CL pneumatic feeder. Uh, this is much the same as loading a digi reel. However, uh, a few things are different, so we'll, we'll go ahead and cover it. As usual, we'll unlock our feeder from the rack. We'll lift our component uh, guide here. We'll lock our feeder in as much as we can. Uh, we can already see that our um, film on the tape is lifting up quite nicely. So we'll go ahead and load our reel into the feeder. We'll route our tape under here. And unlike um, the paper reel, we'll notice that uh, we don't really have much of a leader here. So what we'll do is, just to ease this on ourselves a bit, we'll take some snips and we'll cut the component tape here. That way we have a bit of uh, leeway where we can get our film under this notch. Now we can go ahead and we're advancing our component tape by simultaneously pulling with the tweezers and with the, um, with the film. And so we're going to uh, basically do that until one of two things happens. Uh, either one, we arrive at our actual LEDs, or two, we'll wait for this tape to appear down here so that we can grab it with our hands, which is what has happened first here. So we are almost at our first LED. So we'll pull this tape tight here so that we can close our component guide. We'll lock our feeder all the way into position and we'll route our film into our film collection gear set. Now we'll come and see what this looks like here. And so we'll go ahead and advance until we've got one of these little 0603 LEDs visible. So now uh, this tape is fully loaded and ready to go on the machine.